Hello, my name is Cara. I'm from h and Yacht Vacations. The video I'm about to show you is a crew interview from the wonderful vacation yacht Stargazer. Captain Cactus and Betsy invited me on board to have a look at their new yacht, their owner operators. I had a wonderful conversation with them and their crew. Um, please enjoy this video. If you have any questions about this yacht or any other yacht in the fleet, or you'd like to book this yacht or any other yacht in the fleet, please don't hesitate to call me on plus one two eight four 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 zero three six three six. Or you can drop me an email at cara.rogers at hiyachts.com or info at hiyachts.com. Enjoy the video, guys. <laughs> okay, guys, my name's Cara. I'm from h and Yachts. Uh, tell me who you guys are and where I am. Well, you are on Stargazer, <laughs> okay. and I'm Captain Cactus. Mm -hmm. And this is my lovely wife, Betsy, who is a chef. Hello. Okay. And you guys are owner operators, correct? Yes, we are. And this yeah. is your new boat, but you've been in the business for a long time, right? A long this is not time. your first rodeo. No. Like 15 years. <laughs> yeah, okay. And the last uh, 14 and 13 of them were on a tall ship that was built out of San Francisco, mm -hmm. brought her through the Panama Canal and ran her in the BBI. Wow. Just had a ball with her, but now now we've got a new boat, Stargazer. I'm okay. just so happy. Yeah, to she's be, beautiful to be back. Yes. Okay. Awesome. So tell me about you guys. Who are you? My name is Christy. Mm -hmm. um, this is my husband, Brad. Hi, Brad. <laughs> um, I'm first mate this season. Mm -hmm. um, I'm also bartender and sous chef. Okay. And I'm a mate and just kind of all around helper. Okay, I'm you're our season. water sports expert. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, also. precisely. <laughs> and um, yeah, we. Uh, Hello. <laughs> um, we are most recently from Denver, Colorado. Mm -hmm. um, have a small background in sailing and mm -hmm. just love that. And uh, Christy has a lot more background in charter boats. Yeah, okay. I have here. my six pack and I'm okay. really close to my master's license. Yay, congratulations. Uh, thank you. We love female captains. Yes, yeah. I know. High five for the female <laughs> captains. Yeah, there's a lot more this year. I'm yes. so happy about that. Yeah. Too. Yeah. 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 Power to the women. Yeah, exactly. So tell me a little bit about the boat Stargazer. She's how big? She's 75 feet long. Okay, and she's a monohull. And she's a monohull. She's a Irwin. Yes. Um, owner's version. Mm -hmm. We have a magnificent uh, aft state room, which mm -hmm. we call the Honeymoon Suite. Yeah. And uh, we'll be taking two passengers to four passengers this season. Okay. So you have... In luxury. In luxury. And great service. So you have yes. three, two cabins. Two we, have, we have three, yes. but we're going to be occupied. Yes, of course. Okay. okay. All right. Yeah. We, and, and really, one of the things we do have, Cara, is the largest stateroom okay. uh, master suite of any boat. Can't wait to check it out. I mean, even the one we saw yesterday. Okay. You'll see. All right. So <laughs> tell me about your culinary background. Because you're, you're chef, yes. correct? And you're yes. sous chef. Yes. So yes. both tell me about your culinary background, please. Um, I've been cooking for a long, long time, mm -hmm. obviously. And um, I, the, my, my whole philosophy of food is make it fresh mm -hmm. and make it beautiful. Okay, nice. I like and, that. That's a good philosophy. And yeah, and and it's like what energy you put into your food, you get back out of. Okay. So I really keep a very positive frame of mind and we love to have our guests happy. Okay. You know, they buy the boat for the week and we're there to make sure that they have the time of their lives. Okay, good. And you'll come with that. Um, my parents owned a restaurant for 20 years, mm -hmm. so I pretty much grew up in it. Um, yeah, I've done everything from cooking, bartending, hosting, serving, managing, beverage okay. manager. Awesome. I, I love it. I love being creative mm -hmm. with drinks and food. Um, and she is. Oh, good. I'm yeah. so we like that. I'm yeah, so it's pleased. A lot of fun. Okay, yes. So, so tell me about your sailing background. How did you get into sailing? Uh, well, I was introduced to sailing by a friend of mine in San Francisco Bay aboard uh, Starboats, which are an Olympic class keelboat, 20 foot long. And uh, I was 14 at the time, so I've been sailing. Many years. Many, many years. And uh, I've. Uh, so you're a little bit salty. I'm a little bit salty. I've salty done a lot, of, a lot of yacht racing, yeah. I've owned racing yachts, and crewed on lots of people's lot yachts. So I have a lot of miles under me. And uh, most recently, the last 15 years, I got. Um, I retired from my real job, which I was okay. an architect builder. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah. And, uh, and then I bought. Uh, a boat in, in Tolofa, right? Tolofa okay. and we were in you know commercial service on the west coast. Okay. 
all the way up from us? BC and we ended up in the Caribbean. Yeah. Do you want to tell us the story of Talofa? Yeah, well Talofa is a beautiful was a beautiful uh, ship built in 1928. Yeah. In uh, San Francisco. And Talofa her Talofa means much the same thing as Aloha does. And okay. Only it's Samoan. It's another Polynesian uh, similarity there. Okay. And uh, she was built as a cargo ship, not as a yacht. Wow. Yeah. Did you refit her? Yeah, we refit her completely. Wow. And we did a lot of different services with her. We did everything from sail training to term charters mm -hmm. to cruise ship tours, pirate wow. tours, whale watching tours. We've kind of done it all. Yeah. So we have we a, a lot wide of range of experience. Yeah, like yeah we've yeah. had literally, I don't know how many thousands, thousands of people. Of nice. Okay, I like to hear and, that. And we had to have another boat. Yeah. She did sink. Yes. And she was uh, critically injured. By an a accident. ferry, yeah. yes, but we got through it, and yeah. and we needed a boat that we could love, put put uh, our TLC into yeah. it, and and we've got to have a traditional boat. Yeah. Okay. So, monohull, and, and one other thing is so important to know that my husband is a phenomenal sailor. Oh, We're all we sailors. Yeah. Okay. So we do. Yeah. That's what we do. Yeah. So I'm going to wrap this up and ask you one last question. So. Um, where is your favorite place in the islands to take your guests? You can give me four answers, one, two, or three, out to you. <laughs> All right, shoot. Uh, well, I think my very favorite place is uh, up by the Leos Van Dyke. Okay. And because it's uh, it's an anchorage where um, we can, we're can we not crowded with a lot of different people around. And uh, Little Yost Van Dyke I really like because I call it Goat Island because there's always <laughs> the goats running around and yeah. bleeding and stuff. And I loved, uh, you know, Foxy's Taboo is awesome. Yep. Uh, Sandy Spit's awesome. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a lot to do there. And of course, there's Bubbly Pools, which is always a fun excursion. Yes. Yeah. And I'm going to pick Norman Island. Okay. And the caves. Yes. I really, uh, all our people love that snorkel. Yep. And One it's the, the inspiration best. for Treasure Island. Uh, absolutely. Yep. Yeah. And there's so great much pirate history. Story. And, and yep. this man seems to retain it all. Yeah. I know. Quite the story. I love the story Captain Storytime. Oh. I love Captain Storytime. Big, big Storytime. And, and the nice part about having four is that it frees Cactus and I just a little bit more to really connect with yeah. our, our guests. Indeed. And uh, that's a lovely feeling. What about you, Brad? I would say the baths. Yeah, okay, uh, that's I mean, classic. It is. Um, I really like it because it sort of um, allows for an interactive experience where you people can really think about science in the way that Earth is mm -hmm. formed. And there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of features there that you can point out and bring that story home to people. Mm -hmm. So I, I like giving knowledge. To He's our biologist. Oh, right. nice. That's yeah. a, that's a good <laughs> asset to have on a boat. Yeah, like the the guests will really enjoy that experience for yeah. sure. Yeah. And yourself? Um, I have to say Thinner in. Yeah. Virgin okay. Gorda. Yeah. I mean, it takes a good long sail to get up yep. there. You guys are sailors for sure. Yeah. <laughs> and it's it feels remote. Um, but quaint. Yes. And you know, the turpin feeding over there yeah. is a lot of fun for the guests. And it just kind of feels like you're, you're in a special place, kind of far away. Oh, well, thank you very much for thank having you. me on board and pushing up with me and my video obsession. I appreciate it. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that video. To ask any questions or book this or any other yacht, please call me on plus one two eight four 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 zero three six three six or email me on cara.rogers at hiyachts.com or my other email info at h and i yachts.com remember all the info is down below you'll be able to find the brochure all my contact details and remember subscribe like share share the love and i'll see you next time bye